Okay, here's a quick overview of my plane for Ed that Experimental Airlines contest entry. I built this uh, as kind of kind of a flying wing type design with with a tubular fuselage, based on some of the influences I read in uh, Templeton's thread on RC groups and uh, watching all of Ed's build technique videos. So this plane ends up. Uh, being uh, about 45 inches wingspan uh, with with the state vertical stabilizers on the end. Uh, I've got a uh, RC timer 1500 kV motor uh, spinning a 9 by 5 prop right now which I, I haven't uh, I know that's probably a little too big so I'm looking to probably get a 8 by 4 prop to uh, but I've not been running full throttle by any means so shouldn't load the motor up too bad. Um, I fastened the uh, the wing onto the fuselage with uh, acrylic foam, uh, 3M VHB tape. The wing was formed uh, using the arm and wing style technique. I've got a wing former here that folded over. After I formed it, though, I in between the the leading edge and the former, I put great stuff uh, foam, expanding foam, um, which seems to have made it very stiff and and uh, while well, still lightweight. So batteries in the front here, ESC and uh, RX, Spectrum RX back here in the back, um, nine gram servos uh, connected to the Elevons. So I'll show you how it flies. I still need to trim out a bit of uh, it's kind of got a natural inherent upward uh, climb to it right now so I trim that out a little bit Spins, does rolls quite easily, comes out of them very stable. All in all, very, uh, very stable, easy to control airplane. Do a pass and no throttle. This is just coasting. I do need to set my ESC on brake.
because the prop uh, is auto rotating there a bit. I noticed when I hit the ground, skips a little bit, but no problem so far. All right, try and ease her down here in, uh, in these weeds. Coasted out a little too far, <laughs> a little further than I want to walk in the grass. Definitely uh, plenty of lift.